Hi, this is Alexia Tsotsis, and I'm here with Kyle Seaman, which is a really awesome name. Thank you. And uh, you do High Score House. That's right. And people are really enthusiastic about High Score House. Right. And have any idea why? So I think a lot of people have been waiting. They've seen it with Zynga and these other social games. What is it? First of all, what is High Score House? Uh -huh. I know what it is, but I won't. High Score House to is taking all these amazing social gaming and addictive layers and applying it to productive activities for kids to make it awesome to be a kid again. And applying it to education, applying it to chores, whatever it might be, but really using social gaming for good. So right now it's, it's gamifying chores, right? Right, more or less. So how would it work? How am I going to get my kid? So it doesn't take much. Okay. Um, kids are happy. Once you let them know what they can do to be awesome, they go. So right now, uh, the app, iPad or web, we set up a clearly defined chore list of what's expected of them, and they go from there. Uh, they come in about two or three times a day, really proactively checking stuff off. Parents check in about, you know, daily or every three days and confirm what's been done. But the kids are really driving it. And what, so you're getting points, right? Mm -hmm. uh, a star currency. Star currency. It's easy to understand. <laughs> And what, what can you trade in? So the coolest thing we found is by bringing in a, literally essentially a virtual currency, it can be used for anything. So every family has different values. Maybe it's books, maybe it's games, maybe it's staying up later. But what's awesome is kids don't want just money-based rewards. They want things that are intangibles like staying up later or having that sleepover party. So we're seeing a whole range of uh, use cases where the virtual currency enables it, like ice cream for breakfast, which exploded with all of our users, to um, special time with mommy on Saturday, to picking out where the family goes out to eat on Friday night. So really things that let kids showcase that they're awesome and uh, put them in charge. Why do you think this is interesting? I think it's really interesting because of the fact that we've, for years, have seen how effective social gaming is, mostly the, the social pressure and the mechanics, how fun they are. And people are really drawn to it. And I think it's exciting to apply that to a, to a really productive place. And six-year-olds, eight-year-olds respond so strongly to this. And I also think it's really cool if you're eight and you work all month to buy that new toy and you click buy and it's shipped to your name. None of that exists right now. Now it's going to the store with mom and dad. But I really want to put the kids in control. Uh, who, who's your closest competitor and what sets you apart? So we're in a position where... What we're trying to do is take what Zynga did with social gaming and bring it to the space. And it's a very new application of social gaming. So we're, we're sort of kind of leading the, the race in this area. Um, and what really setting us apart is our real world tie-ins. Other social gaming is mostly online. We're tied into the real life of kids. So they're, they're getting the feedback they love for doing real world stuff and they're coming in. And, and then what's great is they enter us, and then also the prizes are offline. So we're tying online to offline is the big differentiator. Awesome. Thank yeah. you, Kyle. Thanks.